This is Suzanne in France, property reference number CIF 001876. It's a gorgeous detached country house situated at the end of an O3 road and surrounded by farmland. Part of that barn comes with the property. It's an old house and does offer potential to renovate and then just panning around to the house itself. Beautifully presented inside and out. Nice surprise in the little building there on the right with the red tiled roof. I'll show you in a minute. So into a fully fitted kitchen. Space there for a big upright fridge and freezer. A range of matching base units with solid wood worktops. Space for a range style cooker. Space and plumbing there for a washing machine as well. And a butler sink with a mixer tap. Nice view out over the back garden when you're doing your washing up. It's a stable door into the kitchen, so the top half opens separately. And we're going into the lounge. So a nice feature, an exposed stone wall. Got your beams showing. Door there out to the back garden. And a door and a window to the front garden. Fireplace there with a wood burner. That's the view out the back. through then into the dining room. Again, nice exposed stone wall. In the cupboards under the stairs, you've got a little breakfast service area. So the, pre the current owner had thought to do bed and breakfast on the property. So he set it up with a little worktop space for a fridge and microwave. Through then to the downstairs bathroom. Bath got a shower over it, toilet, a vanity basin, and a heated towel rail. Back through into the dining room. This is the place that's set up for sort of self-service breakfast area. Coffee making facilities. Handy to have in a normal dining room anyway. Upstairs now onto the landing. And you have this stunning master bedroom suite with exposed beams. And a massive room with the stonework and the A-frame on show. Okay. 
Looking back down around now, gives you an idea of the size of the rim. Lots of built in wardrobes and covered space. So, view out to the front. Wasn't the brightest of days when I took the video. It's the ensuite wet room. So, built in cupboard space, a toilet, really nice vanity basin. A large walk in shower. Back out through the dressing area. This is size-wise the second bedroom. Double bed. And this is the third bedroom. Again, room enough for a double bed. Outside now, and I said there's a little surprise in this room here. This is an outside dining uh, entertainment space. Charming use of a building. The screen there lifts in the summer, so that can lift up and you've got clear views out over the farmland. Then you go through into the hot tub area and the summer kitchen. You've got space there for a cooker. Space for an upright fridge freezer. Still got the hay rack at the end. Another hay manger at that side. View out over the farmland and as the neighbours in the field. Just panning around looking at the garden, as I said, it's immaculately kept. This first stone building is an old bakery with a bread oven. Looking back at the back of the house. And the hot tub room. 
and then up to the garage, so detached garage, used more for storage, it's got concrete floor, it's got power and light. Boundaries to the fence line that you see. Garage with wood, shop, wood store on either side, a small greenhouse, big garden. If you'd like more details of the property, please head across the website suzanneinfrance.com. Thank you.